Hello everyone, I'm Chef Troy from Classic Bastards Catering and I'd like to wish all the veterans out there all over the world, past, present, and future Arab, future servicemen of the world, happy Memorial Day weekend. Chef Troy is doing something simple today. Uh, I'm just going to season some uh, season some wings and stuff that I'm going to throw on the grill tomorrow. It's raining here, pretty much raining all over the United States. Uh, uh, it, it just about three in, about three inches of rain we didn't got here in the upstate just in the like last two days. So it put the rain all today and put the rain a little bit tomorrow on Memorial Day. So I'm just gonna season some uh some uh, some wings and some drumettes. Uh, I'm gonna throw on the grill. I got some great seasonings. Uh, I got my wings right here in a, a 24 hour. Kosher salt brine. And uh get ready to drain these. Let me get my gloves. Okay, I got my gloves. So I done a 24 hour uh, kosher salt grind with my uh, wings and drumettes I got right here. These drumettes right here. And that brine I got is gonna make the flavors gonna make these flavors pop that I'm putting on this uh on this chicken and that brine is gonna make this uh make this chicken juicy so it's been brining for 24 hours and that salt brine you can make a brine out of pretty much anything but this one right here is gonna give you great flavor right here with the uh stuff that I'm ready to put on here okay I'll make sure I got a drain in it So, so what are you doing for Memorial Day? What are you cooking? Uh, Chef Troy want to know. So put it in the comments below. Whatever you cooking for your family, your significant other, your person that's in the military, in the military what are you cooking for them for uh, Memorial Day? Let Chef Troy know in the comments below. Okay, let's get started. Okay, get these up a little bit. Okay, what season I'm gonna with? I put on, I'll put just a little bit of a little bit of Italian seasons in here. Uh, the key to uh, great cooking and uh, creating an experience and and cooking and uh doing culinary dishes uh great seasonings this right here is a little bit of italian seasonings okay i have a plethora of different seasonings i just am going to put whatever i want in it okay next put a little bit of So much seasons that I got. I, I got to make sure I use them on a regular basis. If I don't, they'll start clumping. I don't want my good seasons to go to waste because they'll clump together. So this right here is garlic pepper. This right here, I'm gonna make it good. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna smoke these for maybe like an hour. Okay. You got to put that much on here because I got so many different kinds of seasonings. What's next? Uh, what's next? Uh, Montreal chicken. This right here is a great seasoning right here. Put this on anything just to make, make your chicken pop. Okay. 
So I uh, smoke and I wanna let these uh let these seasonings uh marinate for about a uh, couple of hours. Okay, what else I wanna go with? Okay, I wanna go with uh Caribbean jerk. Yeah, I let these seasonings marinate on here for a couple of hours. And then I start getting let's get my smoker ready. I want to douse it good with the Caribbean uh, jerk. I wanted to, uh, to uh, take on the, uh, the jerk characteristics. I, I want my chicken to be more jerk than anything. Got all the seasons I'm putting on here because I'm going to put it on the grill after I bring it out the smoker and uh, put that crunch on it. Okay. So I'm gonna season this down real good. I want it to be, I want it to be have that dark, dark jerk look. Okay. Got some stuff in there. Regular uh, some stuff that I wanted to integrate in some stuff and where it was at. Okay. See what it look like. Stir it up a little more. Agitate it. A little bit more here, yeah. get a little, get a little more coating. Like that. Okay. okay. Squeeze some little line, little line, little little bit of line in this. Not the pork part, but just the line, the juice. Do these a couple. Then I go back to uh, put my more seasons on here. You can call this chicken right here. It's going to be layers, layers, and layers, or layers of flavor. Do one more lemon. Lamb, I mean. Okay. Shake them up some more. Okay. A little bit of uh, ground black pepper. I'm going to put this pretty much in here. I don't want to make it too hot. I don't want to make it too peppery. Put a little bit on my hands. And I let it drop in there. This should be enough. Of black pepper. I'm gonna agitate it up. What else other kind of season I got? I got more stuff. Got so many seasons. What else I wanna go with? I guess I go with a little bit of uh, coriander. Do you know about coriander? Coriander put some great flavors. And some food. Mm. The people at the uh, chicken place getting lazy with the uh, pulling the feathers out the out the chicken. Man. Okay, coriander seasoning. Coriander. This right here, I'm gonna put the great flavor in here. Okay, mix it up a little bit, agitate it. Yeah, so I'm gonna let these, uh, let this marinate for a couple of hours. Let the flavors get into it. I'm still putting more stuff in it as I go. Okay, 
just gonna unsalt. I'm gonna put some uh, a little bit of paprika to give it just a little bit of kick. Little, just a little bit. Can't go too hard on this. Bit more. Okay. I'm gonna switch over to some other stuff. Distilled white vinegar. Okay. Got some more cedars in here. And yeah. Let's see, we really got some uh, cinnamon. Yeah, cinnamon. A little some, uh, uh, seasoned it, uh, they put in a little bit of the jerk. The recipe. Little cinnamon. Cinnamon that you make pies with. And make sure I get all of this. Every drop of it. The chicken is gonna be flavorful. Okay, what else are the seasons I got here, okay? Uh, got, oh yeah, these right here are my, uh, you know, I'm on a barbecue competition team, so uh, these are some of my uh, cohorts that I uh, be in barbecue competition with, and uh, this is some of their, some of their seasons they sell online. Uh, smoking Coals, so you can go to smokingcoals.com and purchase this uh, season right here. Uh, these guys, uh, they make some great barbecue. I'm uh, with the barbecue competition out of Clemson, South Carolina, Suey Pig Barbecue. I got me and my four other uh, companions, and we go out uh, Georgia, Florida, North Carolina, and South Carolina in the summertime. We go out probably like once a month. Yeah, we go out once a month. To these barbecue competitions and uh we do this stuff for uh we do this stuff for fun because you know we like the art of uh the art of uh smoking smoking meats and all this stuff and uh we compete we compete with all the top barbecue teams y'all be seeing on all these uh cooking channels yeah, I see them guys in real life all the time. And we have a ball at these barbecue competitions. Uh, I cook all the food for Suey Pig Barbecue. So uh, when not only are we cooking the food for the competition, and I do the food for us to eat the whole weekend. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay, back to the video. Okay, I just put cinnamon. I got about 10 different seasons on this chicken right here. I'm gonna smoke it in a couple of hours. I'm gonna let it uh, let it marinate for a little while. And then I'm gonna crank up the smoker and smoke it. And then I'm gonna put it on the grill and crunch it. So thank you for watching my video. Chef Troy, Classy Bassett's Catering in the Upstate. Happy Memorial Day to all the servicemen of the world, past and present and future. Classy Bassett Catering, love your life. We love your sacrifice and thank you for your service. Thank you for watching my video.